God bless you. Thank God for today. Sunday blessing are coming your way at this hour of prayer. It is my prayer for you today. This week will be good for you. Today will be good for you. Blessings are coming your way. Before asking God for anything today, first thank God for everything. Thank God for what you have, no matter how little it might be. Thank God for the gift of life. Thank God for the roof over your head. Thank God for the grace to have food on the table. Thank God for the shelter. Thank God for provisions. Thank God for protection. Thank God for keeping your going out and your coming in safe. Thank God for not permit any form of evil to come near your dwelling. I want us to appreciate the name of God. Appreciate the name of God that you are alive today. If it's going to be the only thing that you are going to thank God for today. Thank God that you are alive. Thank God for the gift of life. Thank God that you are alive. Bless the name of the Lord. I pray with you today that as far as your journey is concerned, this week, this week is going to be another wonderful week that you are going to enjoy the mercy of God. You are going to enjoy the goodness of God. You are going to enjoy the love of God. You are going to enjoy the favor of God. You are going to enjoy the goodness of God beyond your effort, beyond your calculation. God will not let you down. God will not fail you. God will give you the desires of your heart. God will bring you goodness from Zion. May you enjoy divine intervention of God. Failure will not slaughter your destiny this week. This particular week, you will not run into trouble. This particular week, you will not run into trouble. Trouble will not overwhelm your soul. The ups and downs of this week will not overwhelm your person will not overwhelm your life. The challenges of this week will not sweep you away. I pray with you. May God empower you from on inside. May God strengthen you from on inside. And in the journey of this week, in the battlefield of life of this week, you will not be defeated. It is my prayer for you that God will strengthen you from on inside. God will empower you from on inside to withstand, to stand out against anything, assigned against your peace. This will be your awesome gift this week. That you are going to enjoy empowerment from on inside. Empowerment from the throne of God to live above the ups and downs of this week. I say to you by the mercy of God, you will go out with peace and come in with joy. I want you to pray over yourself. This particular week, you will enjoy the mercy of God beyond your expectation. I want to go ahead to say that in prayer. I want to go ahead to say that in prayer, that beyond your calculation, beyond your expectation, you are going to enjoy the mercy of God. Mercy of God is coming your way at this hour of prayer. Mercy of God is going to be your portion at this hour of prayer. By the mercy of God, by the saving grace of God, this particular week, you are going to enjoy the goodness of God. You are going to enjoy the mercy of God. You are going to enjoy the mercy of God. This week, you will not be defeated. In the battlefield of life, you will not be defeated. In this particular week, you will not be defeated. I agree with you in prayer. In this week, in this new week, new testimony, new goodness, new increase, new expansion, new favor shall be your portion in the name of Jesus I pray with you at this hour of prayer, this particular week, anything that is going to take away your peace, anything that is going to turn your peace upside down, shall not come your way, 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 shall not come your way. God will protect your portion. God will protect your life. God will protect your portion. God will protect your life. God will protect your portion. God will protect your life. God will protect your portion. God will protect your life. God will protect your portion. In Jesus' precious name, we are praying. I want us to pray like this from the book of Proverbs. 3, 6. Acknowledge God. Acknowledge God and He will direct your paths and crown your effort with success. I love the Bible verse. I want you to go into this week with it. Acknowledge God. In other words, put God first. Put God first. 
let God be the priority of everything you are going to do within this week. In everything, put God first. Let God be number one. Let God be at the center of everything around your life this week. Acknowledge God. Acknowledge God. And He will direct your paths and crown your effort with success. Choose to make God your priority. Not just this week. Always. He will not let you down. He will not permit evil to be for you. He will guide your steps. He will give you the desires of your heart. He will not let you down. God will amaze you this week. This is my prayer for you. That God will order your steps this week. This particular week, God will order your steps. This is your Sunday special blessing. Sunday blessings coming your way at this hour. The goodness of God, the mercy of God, the love of God, the joy of salvation is coming your way at this hour of prayer. But when you enjoy putting God first, when you make God your priority, when you put God first, you acknowledge him. Say, acknowledge him. Acknowledge God and he will direct your paths and cry your effort with, with success. I pray with you today. May you receive the grace. May you receive the strength to always acknowledge God. To always put God first. To always put God at the center of your decision making. May God be your number one priority. Because He will not mislead you. He will not mislead you. God will guide you. God will give you the desires of your heart. God will not fail you. God will not let you down. God will answer his name. When he says it, he will do it. When he promises, he never fails. He is always there to support his word. His word will never go without performing the function that the word is purposed for. I say to you this week, acknowledge God. Put God first. Let God be your priority. Let God be number one. And you will be amazed with the results. He will order your steps and cry your effort resources. I want you to thank God again. That God, I thank you for this day that you have made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. Thank God for this day. Thank God for everything. Thank God for all the blessings. Thank God for the blessings that are on their way to you. Thank God in advance. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Thank God for today. Thank God for this particular moment of the day. Lord, we thank you. God, we thank you. God, we thank you. We bless your holy name. Be lifted, I Lord. 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 I want you to pray like this. Please, God, release your grace unto me to always acknowledge you. Can you go ahead to say that in prayer? Release your grace. Release your grace. Release your grace. Ask God to release his grace unto you, to always acknowledge him. The grace to put God first is coming unto you. Pray like this. Please, God, order my steps this week. Ask God to order your steps. Ask God to order your steps. God will order your steps this week. God will order your steps. Today, Sunday, I agree with you in prayer. God will order your steps this week. God will order your steps. God will order your steps. God will order your steps. You will be at the right place at the right time. You will be at the right place at the right time. It is my prayer for you. God will order your steps. God will order your steps. Pray like this. Please, God, crown my effort with success this week. God will crown your effort with success this week. Success is coming your way. Success is coming your way. Success is coming your way. 
Blessings are coming your way. At this hour of prayer, blessings are coming your way. Blessings of God are coming for you. They are coming to you, to the glory of God. This particular week, God is going to crown your effort with success. God is going to crown your effort with success. Pray for yourself like this. My good expectation this week shall not be cut off. Your good expectation this week shall not be cut off, shall not be cut off, shall not be cut off. Your expectations this week shall not be cut off. That your wonderful expectation, that your good expectation shall not be cut off, 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 shall not be cut off. Pray for yourself like this again, that this week you will not be disappointed. This week you will not be disappointed. This particular week, you will not be disappointed. God will be good to you. The mercy of God will answer for you. The grace of God will stand out for you. It shall be well with everything pertaining to you. God's blessings are coming your way at this hour of prayer. Sunday blessings are coming your way at this hour of prayer. You will not be an instrument of reproach. You will not be an instrument of shame this week. This week is going to be good for you. Everything will be all right at the right time. This particular week, by God's grace, in God's timing, this week is going to be a great one. It's going to be good for you. You will not be stranded. You will not be disappointed. The mercy of God will answer for you. The mercy of God will stand out for you. And you will enjoy His divine blessings. In the mighty name of Jesus, I cover everything with the blood of Jesus. May the power in the name of the Lord Stand up for your help this week. You will not be stranded. You will not be stranded. God will stand up for your help. God will stand up for your help. May God bless you and keep you. May God make his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you. May God lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. May the peace of God find you. May you have a blessed and a peaceful Sunday. This week will be blessed. This week will be good for you. This week will be an outstanding one. Why? When you keep the faith, you keep believing, you keep praying, you keep moving forward by faith. Everything is going to be all right in God's timing. In God's timing, everything is going to be okay. By God's grace, everything is going to take shape. Everything is going to fall in pleasant places for you. To the glory of God. This will be your testimony this week. God bless you. You are blessed mightily. May you have a blessed week. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Keep the faith. Keep believing. Keep praying. Keep moving forward by